Well, we did this study because the rising health care costs in the United States as a share of the gross domestic product is presently unsustainable. And we're going to start having to make decisions on the most cost-effective methods for treating patients for their diseases. And we found a 40% cost differential between carotid endarterectomy and carotid artery stenting. Carotid artery stenting was 40% more expensive, and this was due to direct supply costs, the cost of the stent and the embolic protection device. And with that 40% cost differential, there was no difference in length of stay or adverse events between the two groups. In the bigger picture, we're going to have to decide whether to use carotid artery stenting or carotid endarterectomy to treat our patients. And in recent papers that have come out, we've shown clinical equipoise between carotid endarterectomy and carotid artery stenting. So the last uh, ground left unexplored is the cost between the two procedures. As vascular surgeons, we're able to offer both procedures, both endarterectomy and carotid artery stenting. And in a healthcare system where we're starting to have to decide which procedure to offer patients, we're going to have to start deci deciding on the more cost-effective procedure. And at this time, endarterectomy seems to more, be the more cost-effective procedure.